Let's talk about Big Blue. It's that massive building on the Tennessee River that you see when you walk on the Riverwalk, drive on Highway 27, or stand on basically any high point in Chattanooga. For more than a century, the plant produced boilers and turbines for power plants under the company Combustion Engineering and later Alstom. But since 2021, the facility has been home to a different kind of manufacturer, a publicly traded company called Novonics. Novonics originated in Australia, but it moved its headquarters to Chattanooga earlier this year, where it says it's building a factory unlike any in the world. Hi, my name is Daniel Dasso. I'm a business reporter at the Chattanooga Times Free Press, and I recently got a chance to walk through this factory with other members of the media. The plant on Riverfront Parkway could become the first in North America to produce a coveted black powder called synthetic graphite at mass scale. Novonix plans to begin mass production in 2026 after a series of delays. Synthetic graphite is a form of pure carbon that's prized by battery makers because it can store energy for a long time. It's a key ingredient in batteries not only for electric vehicles, but also for batteries that store wind and solar energy on the grid. China currently controls 95% of the global market for battery-grade graphite. Novonix wants to change that, and it says it has the support of the Trump administration through federal funding and tariffs on Chinese graphite. The U.S. doesn't mine graphite, but Novonix's supply chain is domestic because synthetic graphite doesn't come from the ground. Instead, Novonix's process begins with petroleum coke the sooty, crumbly carbon rocks that are left over when you refine oil into gas. Novonix pulverizes the rocks into a powder and then passes that powder through a special furnace heated to more than 5,400 degrees. The furnace is really the secret sauce in the Novonix process that creates a hyper-pure form of synthetic graphite. Novonix CEO Michael Cronley said the company's process has virtually no carbon emissions. Novonix received historic tax breaks from Chattanooga and Hamilton County in exchange for creating 500 local jobs with a $1.5 billion investment. It plans to eventually build an even larger second facility at the Enterprise South Industrial Park. You can learn more about Novonix at timesfreepress.com.